Good morning, you guys. Welcome back to my channel. It's after noon here, actually. It's like three o'clock in the afternoon. Hi, Kai, go get a shirt on. It's like, S go get your shirt on. Okay, so today has kind of been like mass chaos. I, oh my goodness. I just got done with a photo shoot um, for a secret project that's coming up. Something super fun, which you guys will be seeing. You guys will find out what my little project is um, October, November, um, probably towards the end of September now that I think about it. But anyway, so there's something coming for, um, for you guys. Anyway, something that required a photo shoot that will be coming later on um, in September. But anywho, getting my house clean because the photographer came to my house and like cleaning up the house and making sure everything was perfect. Oh my gosh, it was, so the photo shoot was at like 1.30 in the afternoon, and by the time I, like, by the time 1.30 came, I was like, oh my god, I can't keep my house clean any longer, I can't keep it perfect anymore, <laughs> my kids are going crazy, I didn't eat all day, and I'm starving, about to order myself a giant burger, I'm so hungry, I know that I shouldn't have a burger, but I'm going to do it anyways, because... YOLO, I worked so hard on like getting the house cleaned, getting the kids um, dressed, and I had like planned for a picnic um, as soon as we were done with the photo shoot, but it's looking like it's gonna rain now. It's like cloudy and super humid. It's just gross outside right now. August, I, oh, I hate to say it, but like I'm not the biggest fan of August because it's always like where I live, it's so humid and it's impossible to like, curl your hair it's impossible to like wear cute clothes or like look decent outside because it's so hot and muggy it's just disgusting outside and it like constantly thunderstorms because of like how unstable and humid the air is but anyway so picnic failed um so we're having um our snacks inside so we're gonna have some of our snacks inside along with some burgers that mom's gonna order because i'm raving burgers um anyway Riker and I are just having a little bit of a picnic on the floor um he had his veggie straws already um we use all of the blue ellie products for like on the go um containers I've talked about this before but we always use blue ellie I absolutely love their like little snack pouches I keep these in my diaper bag at all times I have one in my vehicle at all times and it just has like veggie straws or like crackers or goldfish or cheese Cheerios, just so many different things that you can put inside of here. I've even used these for sandwiches before. Um, and then in these containers, these are the other containers that I use the second most. Um, Riker is getting mad because I'm taking it away from him. But um, so what we like to use these containers for is is for like cottage cheese and yogurt parfaits. I've showed you guys before in another video um, when we went on an actual picnic and it didn't get canceled because of the weather. Um, I will use the. <laughs> Hi, what do you think, buddy? Hi. We like to use these containers for yogurt parfaits and cottage cheese and soups and things like that um, because, because the container is insulated and it comes with a little collapsible spoon. It's super awesome. Also have some really neat bento boxes and lunch boxes. So if any of you mamas have kids that are going back to school in person in our area, um, the kids are going back to school in person. If you guys are having kids that are going back to school in person, I'd highly recommend checking out Blue Ellie's bento boxes. They're super awesome, they're compact. I like to toss these inside of Blue Ellie's lunch bag to like just in the bottom there with some ice packs and then put the drinks on top. Keeps everything nice and organized. But I highly suggest that you guys go and check out Blue Ellie and thank you to Blue Ellie for sponsoring today's video. So Mama is going to <sighs> DoorDash because, oh, and I also got my lashes done today. I'm really loving the volume on them. We went shorter, but more volume, and they're just looking like thick and awesome, and I love them. Um, anyway, I had them done right before the photo shoot today, which was nice, because um, I don't ever wear makeup. Um, I did not wear makeup for my photo shoot today. I was hoping to go with like more of that like natural mom look. Um, I did at least curl my hair, but I did not do my makeup, because my brows and my lashes are always done, and I just, like now when I put makeup on I always feel like I'm like too like done up I don't know I always feel weird do you guys like hop back and forth between all of the different delivery apps to see like which one you have a promo code for because 
I do it all the time. I'm gonna have to order off of Mike's phone because he has the free delivery. I do not. So hold that thought and I need some burgers. Oh my gosh, this kid is making a mess. Riker, are you having a fun indoor picnic? Oh yum, that's so good. Is it so good? Yeah, you're gonna need bath number three in the last 24 hours. Awesome! Yeah! Oh. Food's not here yet. I just went outside and ordered it off dad's phone. It'll be here in like 15 minutes. Okay? I ordered chicken nuggets and burgers. I know I need to clean your brother up. Riker, what'd you do? Did you make a mess? Indoor picnic failed. <laughs> I did order some nuggets too because cottage cheese won't be enough. And I didn't feel like having sandwiches, so what's up? So that photo shoot that I did, it was so funny. It was so funny, like I like pose like with my camera like in my hands like I normally do, right? But usually nobody like sees me doing that. I'm usually in my house and like the way that I pose for thumbnails. Anyway, I just was like, hmm. Mm. It was very strange like having somebody photograph me posing for my thumbnails and like posing with my camera in my hand. It was very strange. But anyway, I'm just a sneak peek behind the scenes of like what happened today and what that photo shoot might be for. But anywho, okay. I am going to um, clean up the mess on the floor over here that Miker, 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 Riker, <laughs> Miker. I combined your name and dad's name. I'm going to clean up this mess, and then I'm going to organize a little bit, get myself situated, and eat a freaking burger because I'm starving. Okay, so I just wanted to like share like a strange grocery haul with you. I needed just like a couple of like miscellaneous things because we're like in and out of the house so much in the next couple of weeks. Um, this weekend I am going to another bachelorette party and Mike is hosting a bachelor party and we just needed groceries for like, I ordered his separately for his bachelor party weekend that he's hosting. I ordered his groceries to be delivered later on tonight. Um, but anyways, we're both heading out tomorrow. I just had to make sure like we had everything um, like set to go so that it was just easy peasy, right? Just like quick, easy meals. Um, so I got a sandwich for the kids and I to split tomorrow. Um, and then I got myself, um, one of my favorites from Walmart is their chicken um, Caesar salad. It's super good. So I grabbed that um, and then when I go to parties, if I have to bring something for a potluck, so this is a potluck style um, bachelorette party, whatever, um, I will always bring my famous dip. This is not Weight Watchers friendly, but it's very good. Um, so I'll always bring a couple bags of the um, Wavy Lays, and I will bring, and I will make my crack dip. I don't know, I'm pretty sure that I've shared this on my channel before, but my crack dip, all it consists of is top the tater, a big container of top the tater, a big container of um, sour cream, they're both 24 ounces. Um, Yep, both 24 ounce containers. And then you add in like a handful and a half of finely shredded um, like cheddar cheese or fiesta cheese, whatever you have on hand, and then a small package of the real bacon bits. Mix it up, you got your crack dip, and it goes a long ways, and people love it. Like, they're obsessed with it. There's a reason why we call it crack dip. It's actually called BLT dip or something like that. Um, I know my family's been making it for so long, but we now call it crack dip because it's it's terrible, but it's it's super, it's super addicting. Super addicting, super good. Anyway, 
highly recommend that you guys try out that dip if you are going to a party, a potluck, or if you're having just like a little barbecue at your house, try the dip out, you will not regret it. Um, some other things that I typically have to refill on in between grocery trips are um, applesauce packets. I buy at least one or two boxes of these a week. My kids love them and I would much rather give them applesauce or yogurt, like fruits and applplesauce and yogurt. I'd much rather have them snack on that in the middle of the day versus anything else. So super easy. Um, and then I also grabbed three um, breakfast bowls. I got a sausage one. I'm trying out the Jimmy Dean Delights one. This one has turkey sausage. Hopefully it's less points. Um, and then I got this one as well. Um, this is the bacon one. I had this the other morning. I think I showed you guys. But um, these are really good for like quick and easy like fast breakfasts. But they are a little bit higher in points. I think they're like 10-ish points per bowl. And the last thing I refilled on were these um, Fit Breakfast Turkey Sausage Breakfast Sandwiches. I showed you guys this in my grocery haul the other day. And Mike loved them. The kids loved them, so I restocked on them ASAP because they're all gone. Mama. Just got done eating Lupper, and I'm gonna be honest with you guys, I just got McDonald's because it was the cheapest thing on DoorDash, and I was craving burgers. I wanted to go to my favorite place in, or like order in my favorite place from downtown Fargo, but um, I didn't feel like spending $70, so $25, and I got like three burgers and like 40 nuggets, Sprite, three fries, I mean, it's just cheap. Anyway, just showing you that I am a real life person and I do eat McDonald's as well. I always talk about my healthy stuff. Don't ever talk about like the real life stuff, but yes, McDonald's. And it was so good, it was so good. Do not regret it. Okay guys, it is a couple days later now. As you can see, I am clearly sunburnt from that bachelorette party that I went to this weekend, but I forgot to record the end of my vlog the other day, so I wanted to wrap it up here for you guys. Thank you so much for tuning in to today's video. I hope you enjoyed this little vlog. Little like feel in grocery haul, just like a little like life update and some fun things. I cannot wait to share that photo shoot and that project with you guys. Like I said, it will be coming out later this month. I'm so pumped. Anyways, I will see you guys in a couple days for another really fun video, which should be another day in the life for you. So I will see you guys next time. Okay, bye guys.